Ladies and gentlemen, on justice for Mubad, we stand. Justice for Mubad equals justice for humanity. Let us welcome Karimo. Karimo is going to speak to us. She's going to tell us. She wants to speak. She wants to express herself. She wants to tell us what we don't know. We all have been hopeful. We have been waiting for Karimo to spill the beans. Tell us. Tell us that thing. Tell us that thing. We know you know a lot of things. And right now, women's camp, they, they are not in a good shape. They are not in a good shape. I'm talking about those that Wumi paid to sponsor our agenda. She spent Mubat's money. Record that Mubat, Mubat went to a show. He must have been paid. Where is the money? What about the money they said is in Wumi's account? So she has been using that money to pay certain people. They call them speakers. <laughs> to speak in her favor. That's one. Two, we have those who are fantastically wicked. These are wicked people. They are only interested. In fact, they are only comfortable. They dwell where wickedness is. We have those group too. Right now, they are not in a good shape. And we have the ignorant people. Very ignorant. We have those ones too. All of them are not in a good shape. Right now, uh, Karimo decided to release the bombshell. I call it bombshell. And uh, she is going to tell us everything. We've been asking her, Tell us this, tell us that. And I am very sure that you also have questions to ask Karimo. Karimo, tell us this one. Karimo, tell us that. And majorly, what people are asking to know is about the demise of Mubad and possibly DNA. DNA. Wumi and her mother, they are so rattled up right now. They are so rattled up. In fact, Wumi's mother... She does not know what to do. She is so broken into pieces. And, you know, if you know the amount of curses that are sent towards the direction of police people, police men and women, particularly the wicked ones, like Wumi's mother. Why did I say she's a wicked mother? I am not even judging her on what Karimo said she did when she was young. She did when she later... You know, grew up, she did, she died, and she left us. I'm not even looking at that. I'm focusing on what I can boldly say I heard from her mouth. She came on a platform and questions were asked about paternity and uh, the demise of Mubad. She said, eh, hey, is justice for Mubad? DNA or paternity? Why are they talking about that? What is wrong with Buba's father? Why is he? Why is he talking of DNA? What is the use of knowing the paternity or the father of the little boy? Of what use is it? And a question was asked by one of the panelists. Can you tell us if you watched one of these uh, funny drama? Not really funny, a serious one on Uri Yomi Abzad show, where a woman came and DNA was conducted after she had sworn and cried. The child or children that this woman bought to this man does not belong to him. She said, yes, I watched it. So people said, so if that is possible, then this is also possible. Do you know what she said? She said, eh, but nobody is dead. Can you believe it? That's what we are talking about. I'm saying it on video. Oh, yeah, to have a sorry, sir. What is your tongue? I think I start talking. So, because you so long, Moti Babrafi, Nia Coco. So, go see a single cotton to my shay in lag barrel long. Tori, Ije Basso, we bow one day, we bow one more. We bow one more. We bow one day. Eh, the bow one more. Oh, the she, oh, the ribby, Ryan, in my year, yet delay. Or what to get the one bag bay around no no mama feel. And go by all my head on sorrow. It will look bad, ra, quick got to shell and see more bad. Cautious, yeah, could be a moment. One of my paru, one of my paru, 
wa ma so risirisi oro ti e pe awon mo won gan so ma gbo awon ko ti ya won ma so jade lenu gan bo se wa ri ti baba te se yen hun hun mo gbe fun yin te ti yo e dagba e dogbo ko si emi gan ti mo nsoro yi nigbati oko mi wa laye pelu gbogbo nkan ta won e bi oko mi se fun mi ki wa so pe tori pe won se gbogbo nkan yen sugbon mo ma tun ro ite yan kan ohun ni oko mi to so emi ati won po ma wo pe iya mi o si nbe mo baba mi o si nbe egbon iya mi o si be emi si wa nbe tori pe omo mi to eni titi ba si se yen ma si ma wo pe omo yi to ba gbo to o si nbo wa pada wa gbo aro bayin se kan ti mo so ye yin so olohun o le jo mi mo a ba mi ro yin lokan a dun yin ninu gbogbo nkan ti oni kaluku won ba gbe ora won na mama fi se lagbara olohun lai pe lai jina gbogbo e akuku won ko yan fa oro yi 20 years ojo kan sha o ti to sha jade se ti gbo e ma gbera yin se pe mo ejo e ma ti e so eni bi wa so a e se ma adupe ma se ti gbo ma se ri gbogbo adura to ni kaluku to wa lori platform yi awa na ti emi ti e ti adopt yi na e ri message mi later so gbogbo kan to ni kaluku ba so e vi gba pe won ti so be fun awon awon eyan kan ri ko n se titi yin lo ma je ibe lo de ma je opin so let them say anything to ba fe so ko ma so eyin ti tu ba e ti e ti e ti se the right thing so awon lo de ku baba loko won bi mi se ri baba yen mo mo pa bi amo ni won ti won mo pe eyan sha ma bu baba yan a sha la omo to ma bu baba won to ma bu ya won at the end of the ko jo jo won ku lo bayi won wa so mo ti reni to bi mo na n gba to koko o ma nbu mo mi o ni gba to n wo le borun o wa jade o no de kun le pe mo mi mi se nkan te face ni o ni latojo e lo so fun won pe ko si nkan te le so to won ni gbo si yin lenu se yin na de ti se se abi amo yi pe yin na bo kun yen to bi olorun aba yin wo awon mo yin lagbara olorun sha sha eh ai so kai so ko ni so ko ni wonu ile yin lagbara olohun eni ke ni eyan ke eyan ta binu obirin ko ni lagbara lori yin atoko yin ati ile yin lagbara olohun baba yin na to nso baba ya wa dagba fun yin o eh ni saju e lo o a dagba a lo mo mo lagbara olohun ko wa ni eh ni eyin o wa ni eh ni ro eh ni rogun wa la idamu lori won o wo wa ni kuro lori yi kan tun bo sori awon omo yin lagbara olohun gbogbo kan te mi ko be so fun yin ni e pe e ko e e ko ran mo opo yen eni bibeli ohun lo ohun lo ran ni e si e ka gbogbo sam te ba ma so ke ma kale won lori christi yen mu nbe se ti di mu olohun a duro ti di le yin lagbara olohun o ba wa ta de nfe ti yin na won ni wa fun wa otori awon people yen wa ma lo ka kiri from one page to another ni won ni wa fa wa na awa no de ni ba won da si ikan ta mo pa e loruko jesu ko jesu olorun a tell you peace that you should try and do the needful with baba mubad i commend you for doing that yesterday i commend you for doing that because i know it's not easy oh by the way good afternoon everyone i'm so sorry i didn't say hello to everyone queen my sister how are you Like I said, I commend you for doing that because it's not something that is easy. But you came out and you did it. You apologize. And like you said, even if Baba doesn't want to accept your apology now, it's okay. It's okay because we know a lot of damage was done. But at least you try to clear your conscience. and if there's still any other thing you feel like you need to tell him feel free to do so just for you to have that peace and you yourself you said that you know all these people will come for you definitely of course they will but god is for you god is for you no weapon formed or fashion against you shall prosper <laughs> because you didn't come out to do anything bad you came out to say the truth to shed some light to everything that has been happening to things that has been obstructing this justice for Ilerio Oluwa it's 11 months today that we lost that boy thank you thank you for what you did 
I just want you to hold on to your family. And do you know who your families are? My your husband, husband and your children. That's it. Just like your Bashiman so Nire Masopo Leno. And you you said it just now that if anything happens to you, they should hold ya mumi, ya today mumi, and I want to see one fight for mumi. We all had it. Ati Jokotade. But let me tell you, nothing will happen to you. Nothing will happen to your children. Nothing will happen to your husband. Amen. You don't know me. You don't know me. But I happened to, to run into your husband last week. We can speak in camera later. Tori pe won mo oto won de so oto won mo ododo won ko vai se e mo idi number sheri nigba ti mo wa mo wa la be comment section comfy go up now comfy go up now you the fear young daddy comfy go up now ah ah mo pe se ori eyin buru ni se mi ba if i want to come up se mo ni mi o le come up ni abi mo ti wa come up nsin yo but you are the king of my time. You see, wow. fine, carry more shell, shell, one. I'm a quick carry more shell, one. You're so quick carry more shell, one. But now we're standing. She's trying to pay, make peace. In cotton, me, the man, so a meat is so cotton, the quick carry more bare life. Cotton, the poor man, so quick carry more is life, carry more is life. Moti so, mother, to jack out, moti jacko yam on you. Fine, I want your shame, binu, carry more to my sepe, I want your binu, my gentle. Iron, I want your shin binu. Gradually, gradually. Oh, now on your mama calm down. Sorry, a media ko ye won we pay. Ka calm down. Short you understand, pe. Ama pe ka calm down. In kota she ye expect in ye. Ko gent kini ye. Eh? So dra beni ko ye. Ta expect in ye. Ta si ri ye. Mucho pe e calm down. Short year, so gradually. Ah, riba kono. Be mi she le she assimilate or rossi. Or be mo she le she sari understand in your si. Oh my yato. Why do you like that? Why do you think she kill you? 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 Why do you I do cover that when she did What do you mean by that? Can she pass a message? But when Zenob was talking to you, what do you mean by that? Zenob was talking to you. What do you mean by that? What's the meaning of that? What's the meaning of that? Don't talk to me like that. As you are just telling me the way I talk to people over there, you don't like it. So don't talk to me like that. And the Zenob herself have come here. She has talked. And we have moved on. And what first sorrow? Hey, Joshe, and you tell one by to show you. She back by like by to fucking conda. She go she man so on you. She go ya con she bang. Hey, my God, don't she? I'm not even to an sale. I lost a pair. I won't fight the am funje. I won't fight the am funje. Oh, my God, I'm not even to an sale. I lost a pair. I won't fight the am funje. Oh, my God, I'm not even to an sale. I lost a pair. I won't fight the am funje. Oh, my God, I'm not even to an sale. I lost a pair. I won't fight the am funje. This is just the beginning, the beginning of the end. This is the beginning of the end. For our international audience, let me start with what Karimo said. She started with, should anything happen to me like it happened to Mubad? Hold my mother, Wumi. And now, those that are supporters of Wumi, responsible. But she made it clear that Wumi and her mother are directly and indirectly involved in the demise of Mubad. She, as a family member, she being involved directly with what is happening before they betrayed her and she ran away. It is not possible for her to say, if anything should happen to me, should anything happen to me, if anything happens to me, like... So, what does she mean like it happened to Mubad? 
If what we are made to believe is that Mobad was uh, injected because there was a fight that Mobad hit Prime Boy and he got home, they said it was not a big injury. How did that small injury now result into? Oh, they said no, it was just the pain he was feeling, and we called in the nurse. The nurse administered medication. The medication struck a bad note on Mubad, and Mubad passed away. Before we could rush him to the hospital, due to traffic, we brought him into the hospital. D-O-A. So, now, if Karimo is telling us that anything whatsoever that will bring about us saying justice for Karimo, we should hold our mother and Wumi responsible. What message does that, uh, what, what is she sending? What kind of message is she sending? She's telling us that Karimo is telling us that her mom and Wumi are responsible directly or indirectly for the demise of Mubad. It's as simple as ABC. That's it. There is more to what the eyes can see. I knew it and I had that feeling. A very bad feeling within me. I knew it. That Karimo was not saying the truth from the beginning. Like she wasn't saying it all. She, she is privy to it. Now, there is something else that she said. She said later she got to realize that... It was not Moba's father she was speaking to on phone before she arrived in Nigeria. That they had tricked her into thinking she was speaking with Moba's father. Why did Bumi and her mother want Moba to be buried immediately? If they don't have hands in his demise. Why do they want it to be done? How come Moba's father was unable to get police reports? I mean, the report was already written. He had given his statement and they were about to stamp and give him what he needed to take to the mug. Someone quickly came in. That person that quickly came in got a call and was instructed, hey, make sure that they don't get... That's what these police people do. They are always interacting with each other. It's like a cult. They make sure that they have contact and connection to whoever out there manning any police station every dpo whoever that matters they know that's how they operate that's how they operate very fantastically corrupt people wicked people so karimo is making it clear that wumi and her mother are behind the demise of mobile and should anything happen to her they should hold those two people responsible Simple as ABC. You heard it. That's what she said from the beginning. This is not we are trying to make it up. She said it. Should anything happen to me like it happened to Mobad? She didn't say, if I RIP. She said, the way Mobad RIP, if something similar or same happens to me, all these two people responsible. That's the answer to everything. That is the answer to everything. That these two people are responsible. Wumi did what she did. Contacted her mom. They swung into action. Covered up what they needed to cover up. They finished what they needed to finish. They wanted Mubad to be quickly put under the sword. In fact, if Mubad's father... If Mubad father fell into the trap that Wumi set through her mom. They told him to take Mubad to their village. If Mopa's father had tried, he would not have been successful. Because first, for you to transport such a body, you need police report. You need all of that. So they wanted him to quickly go so that they will send police. It will be a roadblock that will stop him. I don't think we'll be talking of what we are talking of right now. Mopa's father would have been maybe taken out. They would have shot him. They will say he was trying to escape. So that he will not request for DNA, he will not request for anything. But the man did not fall into such a trap. Karimo, you have to tell us more. We don't want you to drop it like a... We want you to drop it, bulk. 